the drawing studio. Every studio has pencils, scissors, and glue. You can look at the drawing studio to find the rest. Some things will be coming later. Tips for the drawing studio. You always want to start light, so when we're drawing in pencil, don't press hard because then it's hard to erase. Start nice and light until you get it right. Then if you don't, it's much easier to erase. We also want to start light with our coloring. If we use light colors first, then dark colors can go over top. If we use dark colors first, then light colors can go over top. Also, when we're using pastels, like oil pastel and chalk pastel, we cannot put marker over top. It gets them dirty. So no markers over pastels. Drawing studio rules. Number one, take care of our tools. Lots of our tools are fragile, so make sure we put them away carefully and take them out carefully. Also, when we're using things like pastels, we want to only take one at a time so that they don't accidentally fall on the floor and break. When we're using markers, make sure we push it all the way back in until we hear the click. Number two, put tools back in the right spot. Everything has a label on the container and the shelf, so make sure the container goes back on the same spot on the shelf. If tools are in big containers, just take one pack at a time. You don't need to take the whole bin out, like oil pastels, the markers, charcoal, or crayons. For things like chalk pastels and colored pencils, we can bring the whole bin to our table and then bring it back. For our colored pencils, um, I'm sorting them by warm colors and cool colors, so make sure when we're putting them back, we're putting them back in the right spot. The 3D Studio. 3D Studio Rules. Take care of the tools. Just like with the drawing, we need to make sure we're using our tools properly and putting them back in the right spot. Use what you need. Some of the boxes have numbers on them. That is your limit for how many you can use. So if it says one, then you can take one. If it says four, then you can take four. If there's no number on the box, that means you can take as many as you need. This means think about how many you're actually going to use and take a reasonable amount, not just a big handful. Check your sculpture size. Because we only have so much space to store our sculptures, they need to fit within the size tester. So take your sculpture and put it inside the size tester. If any part sticks out, no matter which way you put it, then it is too big and you need to make your sculpture smaller. If it fits inside the size tester without any part sticking out, then you're good to go. I can't wait to see what you make in the studios.